a couple years ago, I think it was four or five years ago, um, Julie, Janine, and I were sitting around at a restaurant, as you can imagine, as physical therapists, talking about different treatment techniques for different patients that we had that were similar, and we suddenly realized, oh my gosh, what kind of information that we had for each other, and we asked Julie to come out to do a course um, at Neeson Therapy Services, and it really changed our practice. Um, and then at that point in time, we became so excited with the techniques that we had learned and what we had to teach Julie, that Julie got so excited and invited us out to certain physical therapy. So Julie and I were roommates uh, in PT school. So we actually um, graduated in the same PT class and Michelle and I are sisters. And so, um, so really, uh, it's, it was also born out of family and friendship and uh, a love of the physical therapy profession. And um, I think Kyle Sarton said it best when he said chocolate and uh, peanut butter are always better together. And so <laughs> I think um, it's great because orthopedic and um, pelvic health physical therapy certainly are best done together. pelvic floor physical therapist for now 18 years, I've always had to choose a course that was either completely related to the pelvic floor or an orthopedic course or a visceral course. And then I had to take this information and synthesize it myself and integrate it. So as we collectively came together, we thought, wouldn't it be great to have a course where all of that information could be combined in one course so you don't have to choose one or the other. It takes that combined effort, that combined approach um, to, uh, that could enhance both orthopedic and pelvic health. Um, so we really wanted to start to mesh those two realms of practice and really take both to a whole new level. And so it started as something that we wanted to integrate with our own practices, then expanded to something that we want to share with the community at large and other practices and other therapists. And we want to create this different standard of care because our patients deserve it, our therapists deserve it, and it's so exciting when you start to get these improved outcomes that you know, A, we never achieved before, B, it took us so much longer, mm -hmm. and now when we are able to synthesize all this information, you know, it's unbelievable what you can achieve. Make it a comfortable experience to be able to transition to working in the pelvic health environment if you're an orthopedic therapist, and certainly the other way around, if you're a pelvic health therapist, um, then I think it's gonna be easy for you after these courses to um, integrate some of the orthopedic osteopathic, so these are really manually based uh, courses, and they're gonna really help you integrate um, either or both uh, into your practice. So um, if you're looking for a niche practice in pelvic health, but you're an orthopedic therapist and you want to kind of move into a niche-based practice, this is the perfect way to do it, it really is. Thank you.